very rarely do we take to our airwaves here on the Rich Eisen Show and ask the country, the nation, the world to help us identify somebody. <laughs> I need to know who this man is. <laughs> who is this man? <laughs> who is this man who showed to Yankee Stadium last night in full what? Red Sox gear, a jersey, and a Met hat on? Who is this person? I need to know who this person is and how this happened. Is that Calvin Chiraldi? Like, who the hell is that? Who is it? Was I need he, to know. Was he at the Buckner game? How do you what, do that? What are we doing? How do you do that? He was born in 86. Yeah. In the fall. His parents lived in the northeast uh, section of the United States. And Maybe. they just discovered baseball that year. No, no, no. no. <laughs> I'm, I'm not asking to try and theorize how it happens. I want to know who is this man? <laughs> Let's just put that all on Twitter. I who need is his name. Man? Whose man's is this? <laughs> I need I need a name. <laughs> put it up again. Let's just tweet this out. I Who's need the name this? of this man. Nice goatee. He looks in shape. Looks good. Well, definitely. Pepper, warm. It yeah. looks like he was wearing Red Sox gear underneath. It looks tall. What he's wearing. Okay. It looks like he came in full Red Sox gear. It was a chilly night. Yankee Stadium. He's around children. You don't. Look like that around children. You're not allowed around children. <laughs> Look at this. So I, I need to know who who is this man, and then we'll then we'll get to the why, the who, and then the why. He lost a bet. No, that's not a bet. You put, you put a Mets hat on as a dude. As you're a going. Lost to, you don't bet? know you're going to be on national television. You know that someone's going to spot you in that. What the hell? That's uh, just that. that I need to, I need to know. Without speech. All questions need to be answered. But first things first, who is this man? What the hell's going on out here? And what is his malfunction? <laughs> well, that's second. What is the story behind it? Right. How do you go, I'm a diehard Red Sox fan. I'm going to go Yankee Stadium. Sunday Night Baseball. Yan I'm going to Yankee Stadium for Yankees Red Sox. Oh, can't forget my Met hat. What? What? Are you doing? Or you hate the Yankees so much? I was gonna say, how about this? Is what it a if, Yankee hatred thing? What if he didn't have a hat, but his head was cold, but he can't buy a Yankee hat, obviously, so he bought a Mets hat. That makes you colder. <laughs> that makes you colder. I'm just trying to talk it out. I mean, I wouldn't. Ask the Grom how it's worked out. Oh, come what's on. he got to do with this? Come on, <laughs> strap him. What's he? I mean, is he Smoke to do with him? Him. Jeez. One more time. I want to know. <laughs> Who is that man? I need a name. I must have him identified. And I'm never that aggressive, but I, this is this is cause for aggressivity. Pretty aggressive. We have a lead on who our Red Sox clad Mets uh -oh. hat wearing yeah. lead. Found is. it on Twitter. Yeah. yeah. What do we got? We do. What do we got? I send it to Hoskins. Uh, let's see if I don't know if he has it yet. So somebody, what you put something out on Twitter? Oh, I'm friends with him on Facebook. Met him sitting in the seven-line section one game. He lost a bet and had to get a Sox what jersey, but see? could not couldn't not wear his Mets hat. Okay. So he's a no Mets fan. Press Dill Lufo. Yeah, he's Preston. a Mets fan who lost, lost a, bet. a bet. I told you guys, he lost a bet. It had that to be. That is the only <laughs> reason why you would do something that stupid. Wow. Put it up again. So that makes sense. See? You guys didn't believe me. Put it up again. I would never agree to All right. So, if the, so, that's a, so that's a guy. <laughs> that's a guy who's a diehard Met fan. He's a diehard Met fan, and he go. He's so the bet was that he had to go to a Yankees Red Sox game and wear a Red Sox jersey. And here I am on the air demanding to know his his who he is because I think he is um, a menace to society yeah. and. <laughs> So, because it, 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 it does look like he's wearing Red Sox gear underneath the red. Right, right, oh, right. That's an expensive bet to lose because that doesn't look like a, that's no, cheap that material. Like yeah. And also, there's another tweet under that one that says, yes, I met, I guess his name's Sheridan. His wife's at Irene. What's a seven line? What is a seven line? It's a, uh, the Mets fans. Is that the uh, train? Yeah. Oh, on the oh, seven the train. Seven train. So that's the seven yeah. line. But there's another one. His name's Sheridan, I believe. His wife, Irene. He's a diehard Mets fan that lost a bet. We got to get him on the show. Period. End of story. Poor bastard gets gets shot <laughs> on a camera. Uh, honestly, he's got to stand there. He's thinking, I'm one of 50,000 at Yankee Stadium. And, 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 and ESPN finds him. Bottom nine. 
Bottom nine oh. of a one-run game with Judge at the plate. <laughs> on a Sunday night baseball game, coast to coast, and I see it, I'm like, and this screen grab hits me, and I'm, I've, oh my god. Yeah, so the seven line, just so you know, it's the train. No, that I, goes, well, I'm, I'm not explaining on to, it. I've, I'm not explaining it to you. I'm explaining I've, it to the people. Yes, yeah. yes, that's all. And uh, yeah, you know, there's it, a Mets fans that are named the Seven Line Army. Well, I mean, the Seven Train. I actually took the Seven Train to work at at the U.S. Open. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, of it's course, I know you know what great. that is. I loved it, and that's also been was made famous by John Rocker. That, yeah, by yeah, the yeah. way, yeah. <laughs> another <laughs> place you see fans leaving Shea in the old day, getting on the train. On no, the seven train, you could see the seven. That's why on the seven yeah. line, I'm, the, you know, uh, it's it's it's. Yeah, a, I mean, I knew you knew that chain, but I was like, people at home might know. Yeah, yeah. but yeah. So Sheridan is his okay. name, perhaps. Sorry, Sheridan. We're a Yankee hatter. I still need to know who he is, and I need to. I need him calling in. I need to know what the bet was. Actually, brother. What was the bet? We feel for you. Oh, poor bastard. Hey, you watched all the way to the end. Thanks for that. Watch more right here.